But I will say this, what I perceive to be the frustration in this room, and anyone can feel free to correct me, when I read in the Path to Progress, for example, that we should charge retirees for the health benefits, and then I know that when you look at current retiree costs, they're actually less today over 10 years, 15% less than they were. Medicaid costs are down, uh, Medicare costs are down 1.5% each of the past three years. And I know, Steve, we were on the different, we were on the opposite side of this battle, the Chapter 78 in 2011. The reality of it is, is that if you're a public worker, most of you are making less today than you made, to, you know, in 2010. All of us can point to the four different times when pension benefit reform was promised, it was going to be fully funded, and we stand here today with a path to progress to discuss. So there is a great deal of frustration to that. I think what people are looking for is more of a people's path to progress, where we're discussing things that are fair and an open manner. And I, you know, I believe we should have a dialogue, Steve, on S2606. I think it provides... But I Look, we didn't put out legislation yet. We're, we, the legislation wasn't put out for one reason. We want to have a dialogue. You know, and, and, and with all due respect to Senator Ryan, he has his bill, 2606. And I said, not doing it. And I said, why am I not doing it is? Because without the other side of the solution, without the other side of the fix, it, you're going to be back. If you look, health care costs in the teacher's plan, again, Mark will share it with you. An average is 43, it's $42,718. I rounded it up, I apologize. I could have said 42000 right? But the point is, we need to come together because a new plan for you, if you went to this, just to the teacher's, I mean to the state worker's plan, the teacher would save $2,600 out of pocket right now. And it's good health insurance. It's not bad health insurance. So what I'm saying is, rather than us all want to fight with each other, let's look at opportunities and options to reduce the cost of health care so the people that are paying it, which is you and every other taxpayer, we can, look, I think 42,000, 43,000 is offensive, to be perfectly honest with you. I think for a taxpayer, for an average taxpayer, no one promised anybody a 42,000, I'll, I'll go low. A $42,000 a year health care plan is not acceptable. I, that's my belief. Go ahead.